Hey, this is Johnny again, and um, this would be my second video, and uh, this is, just, again, a series of videos explaining my testimonies of the spiritual things that have happened in my life. So with this video, um, I was an adult, a young adult, and it also involved my uh, one of my best friends, um, Joseph Albertsman, or Joey. And we decided to just up and go to California uh, just for no apparent reason. I mean, we told ourselves it was because uh, we couldn't get out of our um, – the whole party realm that we were living in. And, um, so, but that was just a way to justify it in our minds why it would be okay to do something like this. But so we just got up and just up and left Florida and we didn't tell our families or anything. We just left. And, um, so we went to California and along the way, you know, we're reading the Bible and such and listening to worship music here and there. But, um. This one time we 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 were almost we were in California, and we were heading north, but we had to stop in Los Angeles because we were tired. I wanted to get some sleep, and there was the, off the interstate. There was these three hotels, <clears throat> and um, all three hotels had uh, that they had vacancy. They had available rooms, and so we went to each hotel looking for a place to stay. And every single hotel we went to, the front desk lady told us that there are no rooms available. So that was frustrating. Um, those were the only three in the immediate area that we could have stayed at. Um, so obviously we were kind of out of options. And um, upon leaving the last, the last hotel, we were walking through the uh, parking lot back to the car and I just felt like something was staring at me, like looking at me. You know that feeling you get when you feel like someone's looking at you? Most of the time you're right. So um, I just looked and it felt like it was coming from above me. So I looked way up in this hotel, way at the top. There was this um, silhouette of a, you know, just a, a person. It was dark. And they were just like with the blinds open like this, just like looking down at us like that. And I was like, I looked at it, had Joey look at it. I was like, is that kind of creepy? Someone's staring at us like that. I was like, I felt like I was being looked at. And I just looked up there and there it was. And, you know, that could be anything that could just happen. Could be a guy looking out his window. It's I get that. But anyways, so from there, we decided we were hungry. So we decided we would go to eat instead. So we went to a Denny's. And this is like probably two, three in the morning. It was really early. Um, so yeah, we went to Denny's and while we were eating, all of a sudden, um, my friend Joey just got really depressed and sad and, and whatever feelings he was feeling, I don't know. But he was, uh, he just, just got really sad and he started crying. And so... I just started talking to him, try to help him make him feel better. And um, eventually, you know, it lasted a couple minutes and then it was, it was over with. So then after that, I went to the, uh, the bathroom they had there, used the restroom. And while I was on the toilet, the same exact feelings that he was feeling uh, jumped onto me. And uh, that was, you know, just complete sadness, depression, anger. Pretty much any, every bad feeling you could possibly feel, you felt all at once, and it was very strong. So I came out of the bathroom, and I had tears in my eyes, and I told him what I was feeling. And uh, needless to say, we both decided that we needed to leave that area. We just needed to get out of there. So we, after, when we were done eating, we got back in the car, we got back on the highway and started driving. 
And um, the further and further away we got from that area, the better and better that I felt. Uh, just slowly and surely, I felt better and better. So after a while of driving, um, I, I told Joey to grab the Bible we had and just open it to any page and start reading. So we did that. And lo and behold, the passages we were reading, we randomly went to, that Joey went to, were about the principalities uh, palities and powers and the, the rulers of darkness that we, we battle with on a daily basis. Um, you know, not flesh alone, but like principalities, powers, and, you know, the dark forces. So that was just confirmation to him and I that we that was God getting us out of there. And whatever evil was in that area was uh, very strong. And it was very apparent that we did not need to be there. So I'm very happy that the hotel did not have any vacancies. And um, I'm glad that God showed us those things so he could get us out of there. And um, confirmed it in his word letting us know that, hey, I'm, I'm here with you. I'm looking after you. And that was pretty much into that story um, in a nutshell. There's other some minor details I, I left out that I don't think were important, but that was pr pretty much the basic information of it. So, yep, that's it for this, um, this video series. Uh, I will make another one here pretty soon whenever I find the time. And um, hope everyone has a great day. Take care.